Yo, what's up guys? I'm back again with another video. Guys, this time is on another cologne review. And uh, this is on Cuba Red. That's what the bottle looks like right here. Cigar shape. This is 3.4, 3.3, something like that. Cool cigar type bottle. And uh, it's a flask can that it comes in right here. It's a good smell. All right, guys. Now, starting off, this is about the best tobacco-based cologne that I've seen, you know, for a cheap price, you know. And um, the longevity on this is amazing. The projection is amazing on this one. All right. Starting off, guys, the main course in this, the top note is tobacco. It's woody. Warm, spicy, sweet, and earthy. Alright? Now, when you first initial blast from this, the first thing you get when you smell it is just tobacco. Then you get in it to dry down about three to five minutes. You get the woods coming to play with it, with the tobacco. And basically, you get a little sweetness to it. But it stays basically the same way the whole duration of the cologne. And uh, the scent life I set for this one, being this is so strong, man, uh, the scent life for, I give it 8 to 12 hours, regardless of what people probably say. Because, like, when I spray it, guys, I'm going to tell you, I, don't, I, I, I always put it on my clothing when I spray it like this. I try this hit across the top collar part of my clothing. And um, the clothing across here will carry the smell a whole lot longer than it will on your skin, you know. So that's a little tip for you guys. But um, all in all, guys, this cologne, it, like I said, it lasts anywhere from 8 to 12 hours or uh, even longer, especially on your clothes. Stuff smells amazing. I like that tobacco base, man. And um, it's got good silage. It's got a great projection. Now, with this one, I heard some people say the more you spray it, doesn't make any difference. I'm here to tell you guys, that's wrong. The more you spray this stuff, the stronger it gets. It gets stronger it gets. It's get, that tobacco. If, you, if you're not a big fan of tobacco, you probably won't like this one. But I'm going to tell you, <laughs> this one got a real, real strong tobacco vibe. So, if you like me, like that rugged tobacco type smell, mixed in with that manly woods type smell, that's what I love about this one. Uh, this would be amazing for you guys who like that. Now, this one, in my opinion, I would say this is the best one. I would pick this number one from Cuba Line of Colognes. And uh, even though I had a variety pack here, too, also, I'm going to do a review on this one sometime soon. And uh, in this variety pack, it's got gold, it's got Cuba orange, it's got the red, and it's got the Cuba blue. Okay? And like I said, the, the, the best one to me is Cuba red. If I had to rate them, then I would say orange, number two, Cuba gold, number three. And number four, I, I like um, Cuba Gray, you know, which is a good one to me, in my opinion, you know. But, yeah, got this stuff here. Uh, if you look for something really strong projection that really reaches out there, like, whoa, you know, go with this one. You will definitely get noticed because that's about... After about two to three hours, something like it look like this cologne get better. Like some of the tobacco settles down a little more, and more of the woods in this come to play. That's what make it even better. The tobaccos come settle some after about three or four hours. Then most of the woody accords will come up. So that's what make this cologne perfect. And for the price, I paid that was ten bucks for this shipped. You know so. Uh, this I just got this one 
as you can see it's new right here flash steel got the plastic on it and um even the smells in the can a lot right here so um yeah guys I had this before now I don't went through like I don't use had about three four bottles of this stuff so they go to tell you right there how good I like this you know um but I'll keep reordering it up. <laughs> I use it basically, and this is the best time of the year to wear this. I would say fall, winter, maybe cool spring nights. Because um, on a warm spring days and summer days and stuff like that, this cologne will get heavy, too heavy. So um, this smells more like a holiday type cologne, like Christmas or Thanksgiving, stuff like that, you know. That's the kind of smell I got like an autumn, winter, Christmas, Thanksgiving type smell. You know, uh, time we harvesting, you know. Um, it's just a cool weather scent. But like if you throw on like a leather coat and you know, a scarf throw around your neck. It's that type of smell, you know, that'll go mostly for the fall and winter. You know, I couldn't see you pulling this one off too much during the warm spring or definitely not summertime, you know. Because it'll uh, really, the strength of it uh, choke somebody out during the summertime. <laughs> You'll kill somebody with this one over the summer, guys. So, uh, <laughs> so uh, you yeah, know, you really don't want to wear this one when it get on um, hot. Because the way it project, it's just going to, when it's hot, it's going to get worse, see. And I, I, I don't know if it kill you or kill somebody else one with this one on during the summertime because it just ain't going to work. It's going to be way too strong. But, um, yeah, guys, when you wear this, take caution. Now, like I said, it's so strong, guys. I, I'm going to be honest with you. I like to spray this on my clothes more than my skin because this stuff's so strong. When you spray it on your skin, you can kind of feel it, kind of burn a little, you know. So that's how strong this is. So I just kind of, even if, like when I wear a sleeve hoodie or something like this, instead of, I hit my hand with a light mist like that. See, so it's not that wet. But uh, what I do, I take and hit my collar too. Also hit my sleeve collar right here. Right there. It just, and just by putting it over right here on your collar, every time you wave your arm or talk or Whatever that smell going, that, that this shirt gonna carry the, the smell a whole lot longer than your hand gonna carry it. See, when it fade here, the clothing still gonna have it right here. See, and it's gonna last right there until you wash your clothes mainly. So your clothes carry that smell a lot longer than your skin. So they get the, my opinion, to get the best out of your colognes, it's best to just. Spray a lot of it right on your clothing. You know, that's just where I always have done it. You know, they get the best out of it. Because, um, you know, some people got dry skin and the cologne fade quickly on dry skin like that. But them clothes, your clothing going to carry. But, uh, yeah, like I said, guys, you get 8 to 12, I do, out of this cologne. The projection is beast. The longevity is a monster. Um, some cheapy, you know, like I said, I paid 10 bucks for this shipped, you know, so, um, can't beat it, this is a new ball, I just got this today, and I had several of them before, you know, guys, um, I done went through like four bottles of this stuff, three or four bottles, that's how good, I even had a Magnum one, I like that tobacco in here so good, man, I just keep buying it over and over and over again, as you can see, it's a fresh baller. See ya. Fresh off the top. Cool baller also, guys. Good for your collection. And um, I know y'all heard a few people talk about this cologne, but not many, you know. Besides me, I got a couple videos up on this before. But uh, this one, my new can, so I just want to come do a, redo a video to my new channel. So guys, if you're looking a good tobacco base, Cologne is cheap, great projection, great longevity, great sillage. Tell you guys, go with this one. You'd be surprised. 
and what it does for, for $10. And uh, some people say it smells like John Barbados Vintage. Some people say it smells like Burberry London, you know. So uh, I would say it, it smells similar to the two. But guys, I would say this is stronger than those, you know. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to say this is stronger than both of those. Barbados and uh, London. I would say this is the way to go for the price. This is stronger than both of them. Now, that's just the way it is. For ten dollars, you go with this one, and you won't be disappointed. I'm telling you, you can just x the other two out. They much more pricier anyway, and they, they the tobacco note in this is way better than both of those. All right, so guys, there you have it. This has been a review of Cuba Red. All right. The best tobacco-based cologne in the game right now for 10 bucks shipped. All right, guys, new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Don't forget to share my videos. And, guys, stay tuned for the next video. Don't forget to share them now. Hope you enjoy, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Go pick this up. Order this on Amazon or eBay for 10 bucks. See you guys.